we will have a comprehensive written summary that will be uh, released to all of you uh, later today as soon as it's finalized. Uh, I'm not going to get ahead of that. It's, of course, done uh, by uh, medical experts, which is as is appropriate, uh, but we will release that out to all of you uh, later this afternoon. As I noted in a tweet, uh, I hate to reference that, but here we are. Um, earlier this morning, um, the President had a conversation with Vice President Harris uh, as well as uh, Chief of Staff Ron Klain at around 11.35 this morning. Uh, he was in good spirits. Uh, he resumed his duties as president at that point in time. There was also uh, two sets of letters that we released publicly uh, around one was at 10, 10 a.m., the other was at 11.35 a.m. Uh, about the transfer of power under the 25th Amendment and the resumption of power. Uh, so, uh, but that's a reflection of how he is and how he is feeling. Can you explain the timing of the physical today, what was behind it? Did the fact that the president is turning 79 years old tomorrow have anything to do with the timing? Did he want to have that before his birthday? The president is well aware that his birthday is a matter of public record. Uh, as the president of the United States, I can confirm that. I will say, Kristen, we uh, knew that we were going to do, he wanted to do and committed to do a physical before the end of the year. Uh, so this is obviously meets that timeline. Uh, and obviously we work through scheduling availability and requirements uh, in order to do that because any president is typically at Walter Reed for a couple of hours. Again, for people who haven't been paying us close attention.